Hi, welcome to Wise Guys. This session is about volume percent. Because concentration of solution equals amount of solute divided by amount of solution and multiplied by 100%. The volume percent equals volume of solute divided by volume of solution multiplied 100%. Same unit for both solute and the solution. So as long as you have same unit for solute and the solution, and this is also after dividing each other, this is a, a ratio, right? So if volume of solute using milliliter and volume of solution also use milliliter. And or we can use volume of solute use liter and volume of solution also use liters. So same unit for both solute and the solution. This is a, you need to be very careful because talking about liquid volumes of different substances are generally not additive. That means when you using when we using volume percent at the last situation is the volume of solute, this is the solute of the liquid or aqueous. So also both measure as uh, as is our liquid. So that situation we use volume percent. And because if you have fifty milliliters of solute plus 50 milliliter of solvent and you know it's precisely you will not get 100 milliliter of solution always less so that's why is different substances is liquid volume is not additive so that's why when we do this question, we need to know volume of solute and volume of solution. So for example, wine is about 16.5% and volume to volume. This means there are 16.5 milliliter ethanol for every 100 milliliter of wine, or there are 16.5 liters of ethanol for each 100 liter of wine. And the next, let's try two questions. The first question is 25 milliliter of an acetic solution is added to a certain amount of sterile water to make a total 200 milliliter of solution. What is the volume percent of as an acetic now? So to calculate the volume percent of an acetic solution, we use formula use the volume percent, we say volume percent, which is volume to volume equals to and the top is volume of solute. And this question is 25 milliliter of an acetic solution. 25 milliliter is added to certain amount sterile water to make a total 200 milliliter solution. The solution total is 200 milliliter. Then multiply 100%. And then we got milliliter, milliliter, same unit we can cancel out. So 25 divided 200, we use 25 divided 2, which is 12.5 over 100, multiply 100%. Then we got 12.5%. 
percent, right? Because this percent, hundred this hundred cancels off with twelve point five percent. The first question, the second question, I say the same as the first question. So look at the second question. And how do we make 300 milliliter of 4% habitant skin cleaner? To make a solution with liquid solute, we need to measure the amount of solute in a beaker. Then we add the water to total solution in 300 milliliter. To do so, we need to first calculate how many milliliter of solute is needed. So follow the given information, 4%, we start from 4% equals to, to looking for milliliter of solute, we put the X milliliter and total solution is 300 milliliter. So they have same unit, right? Same unit. So we can cancel out and then multiply 100%. This is exactly follow the formula. And to calculate the X, we don't need this one because actually this 100% equals one, right? So that's why we're only working with 4%, which is 0 0.04 equals x over 300, right? Because this is a milliliter and this is a milliliter. So that's why we have x equals 0 0.04 times 300 milliliter, right? Because this is milliliter, milliliter. So we have x equals 0 0.04 multiplied 300, which is 12 milliliter. That means we measure 12 milliliters of habitant skin cleaner, which is this is a concentrated, and put in a bigger, and then add water to total volume equals 300 milliliters. That's what we need to do. So this is presented by Wise Guys. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.